Let's start this exciting journey by introducing you to none other than the future king, Prince George. This lively, playful young boy is the eldest child of the Prince and Princess of Wales, William and Kate. Since his birth, the media spotlight has been shining on him, but his caring royal parents have done their best to give him a somewhat normal upbringing, we've seen Prince George grow up before our eyes, attending royal events and historical moments like the grand funeral of his great-grandmother, Queen Elizabeth II, and the magnificent coronation of his grandfather, King Charles. But what have we learned about this young royal from all these moments, born on July 22, 2013? At St. Mary's Hospital in London, little George made his debut into the world, and the public was immediately enchanted. The first glimpse we had of him was in the arms of his mother, Princess Kate, and we couldn't help but notice how adorable he was. His proud parents, still adjusting to their new roles, said they were trying to come up with a name, and when they finally did, the world learned he would be called George Alexander Lewis, a name fit for a future king, his birth was more than just a personal milestone for the royal family, it was a historical moment. For the first time since Queen Victoria's era, three generations of direct heirs to the British throne were alive simultaneously. Thanks to a change in the law, had George been a girl, she would still have retained her place in the line of succession, marking a shift in the monarchy's traditions. Speaking of tradition, it's thought that Prince George was likely named after his great-great-grandfather, King George VI, who was known for his steadfast leadership during challenging times, a legacy that George is sure to be influenced by. But that's not all. Fast forward to when Prince George started showing more of his personality, it's clear he's not just your typical future king. He's a little rascal, as his dad, Prince William, lovingly put it. His fun-loving nature and boisterous charm have captured the hearts of royal fans everywhere. As time went on, William and Kate sought to protect George from the prying eyes of the media. After all, every parent wants to give their children a bit of privacy, right? Even royal children deserve to play and grow without too much scrutiny. However, there were still adorable moments we couldn't miss, like the first official photos of baby George, taken by none other than his granddad. Michael Middleton, one of the first key milestones for Prince George was his christening in October 2013, which took place in an intimate setting with close family members. Then, not long after, we saw George engage in his very first royal engagement, at just eight months old. During a royal tour to New Zealand, George attended a playgroup with other babies, and it was clear even then that he was already stealing the show. The royal couple has remained dedicated to ensuring George experiences a relatively normal childhood. However, as a member of the royal family, he naturally has duties and public appearances. Still, William and Kate made headlines for their fierce protection of George's privacy. Even taking legal action when photographers got too close, by the time Princess Charlotte came along in 2015, George had already won over the hearts of the public. He proudly welcomed his little sister, and they were soon seen together at royal events, charming the world with their sibling dynamic. From there, we saw Prince George start his schooling at a Montessori nursery, following in the footsteps of his dad and uncle, Prince Harry. He even had the opportunity to meet the Obamas, dressed in an adorable bathrobe no less. President Obama even joked about it later.